All right, so today we're going to try this new mod pizza. It used to be a Burger Masters. But they have a drive through. Check this out. It is huge. Look at this. It's still open. Hold on. Let me see if I can go inside and order. All right, so I just picked up my pizza. All the servers in there wore masks, which was much appreciated. Now I'm just gonna go through the drive-through. I've never seen a mod drive-through because this used to be a Burger Master, so they used to have a drive-through. I guess they just incorporated it in there. I'm just gonna drive through right here and show you guys. Oh man, now I gotta wait in the line. <laughs> I was just gonna show you guys. Hope I was hoping that I would just drive all the way through. Well, for you two, I'm doing it for you guys, all right? So you, you see the menu, right? Oh man, this might take a while. <laughs> I already ordered, I was just checking out the drive-thru. Okay, how do you order? Yeah, I already ordered. I meant I already picked, I was just, I was just inside. Thankfully, that, that didn't take long. So, we're just located right here, right across from Buick. They even have a heat out place. I think this is the biggest mod I've ever seen. So, go check it out. What's up, guys? Welcome back to J Roo Productions. Welcome to my temporary home office. It's my work from home station. So, today I went to the brand new mod pizza location, which used to be a Burger Masters. I think one time I tried to do a review of them, but I lost the video, so I never completed it before they went out of business. So my piece of bought them out, converted into a brand new building, new establishment with a lot more better parking, a drive through a first ever my drive through Have you ever seen that? And the inside looks extravagant, and I actually, I absolutely love the engine design. It makes me wonder if it's like a used to be a Boeing engineer that used to own it. So I started out with the Red Dog, which is basically a mozzarella, medium-sized pizza, personal size, with, um, let me see if I remember it. Ground beef, mild sausage, pepperoni, and red sauce. But let's get a better look at this. All right, guys, let's see what all my pizza consists of. All right, so, and on top of the red dog, I asked them to add some chopped garlic and um, what's it called? Basil. <laughs> Added cloves of roasted garlic, uh, spicy sausage. I actually told him bacon, I think he forgot about that. And mushrooms to complete off this, and olives, of course, to complete off this pizza. Let's go ahead and take one piece. Let's see the bottom, see it cooked it properly. See that? Not burnt, not soft. I like thin crust pizza. That's why I love mod. It's not overly oily like the ones you get from you know your local franchise like Domino's, Pizza Hut, not this and them or Papa John's, which is my favorite franchise. So let's go ahead and bite into this bad boy. Feeling comfortable right now in my gaming chair. It's gonna get a whole lot more comfortable this pizza in my stomach here we go I haven't had my pizza in almost three months since the quarantine mm. Mm. all those enticing sexy flavors combined into one mouthful mm. that's quite a punch 
no, 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 um, my first impression is that, yes, it was quite delicious because I haven't had it in a while. Love that thin crust. It's definitely a meat flavor pizza. I just wish that, there were, there was, for some reason this time they didn't put enough cheese. You know, typically it's cheesy. Maybe they were skipping on that. Maybe I could, next time I definitely ask for extra cheese. The meat game is definitely proper. Um, also, I noticed that it was a little bit salty on the salty end this time. Probably because of all the meats that they typically marinate with salt and black pepper or something like that. So I think a lot of restaurants need to take note. Sometimes a natural taste tastes better. Cut down on your sodium. Like put half the sodium that you guys usually put in there. I know that sodium preserves the meat, but it's not healthy. It leads to high cholesterol, diabetes, all that stuff. That's just my own personal opinion, all right? But this is a tasty pizza regardless. Maybe I should have added some pineapple. I know some of you guys are weirded out by that, but I like the sweetness in it. It completes that food flavor palette. I'm so happy that I finally went back to Mod and especially checking out the brand new location, especially if you guys in the Seattle area, go check them out. It might be the only Mod pizza drive through in the whole United States, who knows? So what do I recommend? Do I recommend this pizza that I conjured up? Yes, I do. On a scale of 100%, I'm gonna hook this up with a 86%, guys. Hope you guys stay safe out there. And if you are hungry for a pizza, go stop by Ma because it's like the uh, subway of pizzas. Until next time, take care of yourself. Eat hard, work out hard, baby.